Hey guys, so today's video is me and my friend getting ready for Halloween. We celebrated it together and we were both goddesses. In this video, you'll see us goofing off a lot, but yeah, that's just how it was for the video. So I'm starting off by using the L'Oreal Power Moisture Detangler in her hair to get all of the tangles out so we can brush it before we do anything else to it. And then I'm taking the Tresemme Thermal Creations um, heat protectant in her hair to protect it from the heat that we're about to use on it. I'm tying up half of her hair into a bun and then um, curling the bottom half in tight curls. And after that, I'm just taking the rest of her hair down and finishing the top half in more tight curls. So, yeah. Anyway, so now I'm using the Garnier Fructis Anti-Frizz Serum in her hair to get rid of frizzies. And then I'm taking the L'Oreal Lock It Fine Control Hairspray and hairspraying her hair so that the curls stay in all night. And she made some pretty cute faces while I was doing this. So, yeah. But this is what her hair looked like. Pretty tight curls, you know, really cute. And then I did the exact same thing to my hair. Nothing different. I just did tight curls all in my hair. And then I used that Garnier Fructis Hair Serum for my frizziness. And then I also used that L'Oreal hairspray to make it stay all night again. So yeah, these are my curls, pretty much same thing. And now for Madison's makeup, I'm using the Clinique Acne Solutions um, foundation for her and, and using a Real Techniques buffing brush to blend all that in. The reason why I'm using this foundation is because it's hers and it's what she uses. And now I'm using my CoverGirl Ready Set Gorgeous Concealer on her. She doesn't have a problem with bags, so I only put a little bit to kind of brighten. And then I'm using my Maybelline Fit Me powder to mattify everything. And then I'm taking a brighter powder um, with another brush and putting that under her eyes to make it, you know, brighter and mattify. And then I'm taking the Rimmel Natural Bronzer and contouring her cheekbones and also making her face, like, more bronze because we're goddesses. And now I'm taking my Clinique blush and popping that on her cheeks, not too much. And then I'm taking the Mary Illuminizer Highlighter. I'm priming her eyes with the Hard Candy Eyeshadow Primer so that our eyeshadow stays on all night. And then I'm taking the Naked 2 Urban Decay Palette and I'm putting tees in her crease with the Fluffy blending brush and then I'm taking Maybelline the nudes palette and then I am just spraying that with a matte finish NYX setting spray to make the gold more pigmented and I'm just taking the brush that comes in that naked two palette little kit and then I'm taking busted in the outer corner with that with the other like blended side and then I'm taking a Tristique um, nude little pencil for like mainly just outlining the lips and then taking a the balm really super nude lipstick because we're goddesses and the main like theme was nude and gold and stuff like that so yeah I applied false lashes to her off camera but that was her makeup the glue was still drying and everything I think it was really pretty and super goddessy I guess you could say but now starting with mine I'm taking a Rimmel BB matte um, cream this stuff is really good and super high coverage for a BB cream but that's what I'm using on my face and I'm using that same Real Techniques bling brush. This was my first try using this NYX highlighting concealer. I liked it, but it wasn't super full co coverage. It was just really, like, good for highlighting and stuff. So that was the first concealer that I used. And for more of a covering, like, for more coverage, I used a Rimmel Mat uh, Match London Perfecting, I don't even know, concealer. And took my uh, Real Techniques brush and blended that out. Then I'm just taking the same Fit Me Maybelline powder and then the same brightening powder. Basically, same thing. Then I'm bronzing with the Rimmel London Matte Bronzer, same exact thing, same Clinique brush, putting that on the apples of my cheeks. All of these are Real Techniques brushes, by the way, and the same Mary Illuminizer highlighter, basically almost the same makeup. Doing my eyebrows off camera and then priming my eyes with the same primer and using the exact same shadow, blending teeth in the crease. and crease. <laughs> but then I'm going to take a Maybelline Color Tattoo um, Gold Pigment because I just wanted to try it out and I forgot I had it. Spraying it and then putting that all over the lid with the Naked 2 brush and then putting um, Busted in the outer corner. So yeah, it's a super neut neutral gold smoky eye and I like it a lot. And then I'm taking the same Tristique little lip pencil type thing on my eyes. I put on false lashes um, off camera, and then I'm using the same, the Balm little lipstick, nude lipstick, <laughs> yeah, and then they annoyed me, so I just took them off and applied my Max Volume Mascara, and then my Clinique Mascara after that. They really got on my nerves. They worked for Madison, but they did not work for me, so I just took them off and used mascara, and then I'm spraying my face so that my makeup stays on all night, but yes, that is my makeup. I think it turned out really cute. It was really pretty. We had basically the same makeup. 
And then we used a Nicole Opal nail polish or something for our nails because of the gold thing. Madison's just wearing some sandals and we made togas with sheets and she got her gold rope from Hobby Lobby. She's also wearing a statement necklace that is silver and gold with the matching earrings. We had diamonds on our eyes too and she made the crown, the gold crown with the leaves, everything from Hobby Lobby. I'm wearing some heels from Target. They are nude and I'm also wearing a toga with a gold um, little waist rope and also the same jewelry and the diamonds across my eyes but with a different different gold leafy diamond like headband and then my sister wanted to show her Halloween costume so she was wearing a crown a pink toga a gold necklace gold rope and with some pretty makeup and pink bedazzles so yeah this was our outfits I think we looked good overall I ended up changing to sandals um, brown like braided sandals because they were hurting my feet but yeah I hope you guys liked it subscribe